My question is to the Minister of Education. Minister, information skills are crucial to the success in the 21st century of our students. Students need school libraries staffed with trained teacher librarians to develop these skills. But in Ontario, according to the uh, report from People for Education, fewer students than ever have access to teacher librarians, and school libraries are closing left, right and centre. Why is the McGuinty government allowing the gradual yet dramatic death of school libraries in Ontario? Uh, speaker, well, I'm very happy to have this opportunity to clarify for all the members of this assembly that uh, there was only one government that actually cut funding for libraries and library resources, and that was the previous government. Our government, on the other hand, has increased funding in education overall by 46 percent, but certainly directly to libraries as well, because we see them as very important resources. And I think if you read the report carefully, you will appreciate that actually the number of school librarians has increased under the term of this government. We will continue to work with boards. And, and I, for one, had the opportunity to visit many schools where one of the first features in the school that they want to take me to is their library library because it is such a wonderful and valuable resource that supports student learning and student Excellent. success in our schools. So uh, I say, especially to those locally elected boards that might be considering pulling back. Thank you. Supplementary. We are witnessing the dramatic death of school libraries in Ontario. She says everything is great. I just don't get it. She also knows that library cuts are taking place because school boards are struggling to balance their budgets as they are dealing with aging buildings, declining enrollment, and increased student needs. Instead of blaming boards, as she has done, why won't the minister give the st their students the best shot of success and put in place a policy? And funding, by the way, wouldn't, wouldn't, uh, wouldn't be a problem to ensure that all Ontario students have access to school libraries and trained teacher librarians. <laughs> Well, again, I'm very happy to have this opportunity to educate the honourable member that since coming to government, this government has increased funding for school librarians and school libraries by 12%. Wow. Uh, that in the face NDP of declining enrollment. I would also say to the honourable member that in addition to this commitment, over $40 million has been committed over four years for elementary school libraries. So this coming year, boards are receiving $589 million in funding, particularly for textbooks and those resources, uh, many resources, that will be placed in libraries. So again, I say to the honourable member, we have been increasing resources to school boards. There are boards that are actually question, looking for innovative ways to invest in their libraries. I'm very disappointed that there are— New question,